Someone is running from there. Maybe they will uh, step into my other trip mine. And honestly, I think that the Wellspring guy is just running, you know? Maybe it's not only my... Uh, my compass. Badly calibrated, but this guy is just changing his position. No, he's here, okay. Dude is running here. We'll quickly maybe try to slap him. Okay, boy. Hello, hello. Alright guys, hello everyone. Uh, welcome to another episode from the daily quick play match. Uh, but today episode, as you maybe see uh, by the thumbnail, will be very much special. Because today we are playing without a map. And without the compass, okay? So this will be definitely different kind of a gameplay. I think uh, more immersive, I would say. We have to be much more focused. And actively like think about our plan and positioning. And we have already a player in, in the proximity. So they had to spawn on the other side. Yeah, I, res I respect the idea, man. Good fight. Yeah, so he just wanted to push me with some freaking katana or to what we did. I mean, the yeah, what was it? It was katana or the saber? Yeah, saber. I will take it. And uh, yeah, I'm intuitively like pressing the map button, but just nothing is happening because I re removed the keybind. Let's take this, let's uh, close the rift, alright. We have Sparks, we have Springfield Bio. Mosin Obles Mace, yes, thank you sir, alright. And right now, as we don't have the map, we need to like judge what's going on by looking like this. So, I think it's... the mob battery is active. Lawson Station and the Blank Briner is active as well. So I will head for the Blank Brinery and potentially um, I will keep going next for the uh, Lawson Station. That's the main plan. Is it Lawson Station right there? Should be, yeah. But I can see only one rift. Yeah, it's the Lost on Station, obviously. Okay. Uh, definitely we're gonna close this, because it was really close. And uh, we'll see where the game will keep leading us. Anything interesting? Not especially. Honestly, with that uh, with that Mosin, uh, there is not quite many guns uh, to choose from instead. Okay, we can use this, so we have a free slot. Uh, let's put the healing on the quick access. This is for free because we have space. 
I'll loot the altar, okay, and let's check the surroundings. Okay, we have uh, we have two rifts uh, still active at the Lawson Station. So it's completely fine. Yeah, you don't want to scare the emulator because it's really loud, yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, we should be able. To, I mean, we'll see, but it would be nice to close both of the rifts, uh, so we could activate the wellspring here. That would be really nice. We have the other one. Yeah, we have. Okay, perfect. Wait, there was something here. I just realized right now. Vitelli silencer. Officer Carbine. Okay, so there are some other players stole the um, the wellspring, and I think it's at the Golden Acres. So uh, yeah, unfortunately we'll have to attack first. But we have a really strong build that sh there should be no no problem about that at all. Wait. These are the golden acres? No. It's the next is the next compound, the Stalter's Pork, okay. And we found the resupply. It was barely visible. But I somehow spotted it through the trees. Oh, it's even Arden Parish. Oh lord, okay. I've mistaken everything. Yeah. Okay. Mako Carbine and Snagant Officer. But I will not be able to pick up only one of, the, of those guns. Yeah, it will always... I really like to play the Mako, you know? Poison Trip Mines... No, doesn't make too much sense. Okay. Can I improve? I will maybe just take the Mako instead of the... Yeah, it's always also the Claw. 150 damage with light attack. Yeah, I got confused uh, with like my... Uh, mental compass. But Arden, Arden Parish is even easier to attack, actually. Wait. I cannot see the guy on the dark side yet for some reason. Oh, maybe it's behind Arden. So that would be Nikol's prison, yeah? I think my mental compass is calibrated already. Nope, I don't want that. Oh, yeah, it's gonna be Nikol's. Or, he's just running, like, you know, into nowhere. That's also a possibility. Wait, no, no something is off. <laughs> it's windy now. Jesus. I was trying, like, I was playing the previous uh, game at the Stillwater Bay, and my... Uh, my mental compass was way better. But uh, here for some reason I... yeah. I misjudged. That was a nice long range kill. I'm not sure if there's gonna be anyone else passing through here, but... And Windy Run is, yeah, somewhere there, okay. Yeah, you see guys, honestly, I thought it's gonna be uh, 
better, I would say, with like being aware of uh, my position, the surroundings. But here I got really, really, really confused. Someone is running from there, maybe they will uh, step into my other trip mine. And honestly, I think that the Wellspring guy is just running, you know? Maybe it's not only my... Uh, my compass... Badly calibrated, but this guy is just changing his position. No, he's here, okay. Dude is running here. We'll quickly maybe try to slap him. Okay, boy. Hello, hello. Okay. So the hive bomb gave us uh, an initiative because the guy had to move. It was a nice kill. Very, very good use of the hive bomb. Caldwell Liver Spitfire, nope. Okay. He's playing from the rooftop. Really, bro? You sure about that? Okay, and that's it. I think that's it, yeah. Uh, that was a good game, but I have to say, uh, yeah, it's quite interesting playing without the map and the compass. But I got confused harder than I thought it would be. GG, guys.